Let me introduce it. Let me introduce myself. I went to university. Warwick, motherfucker, good seat of learning. I got a 2 1 BA with the honors in town planning. So if you fuck with me, I will build a roundabout on your face. Yeah? I like and I'll love to an outdoor barbecue. And it don't matter what time I want to slap my meat on the grill. Those flames are going to lick it and they are going to cook it. Once I had a wife and two children. Now I have a car and a house full of rubbish. <laughs> My name is uh, Dave Pike. Former stump man. Man of danger. <coughs> Papa died soon afterwards. A mid-sex seizure. Brought on by a surfeit of port, blue cheese, and moody Russian Viagra. <laughs> of course, he left nothing to me, next to nothing to Mama, save for a lame horse, a suit of armor, and rather inexplicably, a bulwarker, home gym appliance still boxed. And why not invite thy neighbor and his wife over, lay on some crudité and dips, before getting down to some good or honest fornication in praise of the Lord in the spare room. I want to hear a hallelujah. hallelujah. Amen. This is a, a sliver of the bishop's finger. Oh, fuck. It smells like the bishop's nutsack. It's unbelievable. And I got a job as a trouser salesman in a department store. I don't want to name names because they were so objectionable. Herods. Herods. Horrible, hateful, whoremongering, Herods. I was doubling up for such luminaries as Tony Danza, Scott Bio, and weirdly, the midget from Fantasy Island. Frightening gig. The house was then left to fester away like Luton. I tell you why it's rare, mate. No prick wants it. You go into any minimart, any supermarket, cheddar, 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 red Leicester, cheddar, cheddar, maybe mini baby bell. <laughs> Ladies, you may undress me mentally. Gentlemen, not so much. As sure as the bears come down from the mountains in the springtime looking for food, so too did my ex-wife and my sons, smelling the money, yes. And I would stand on my car and I would shout, suck my balls! That's the thing about Americans, they don't give a fuck. They stare right back and go, go on then, do it, yeah. I met her whilst I was over here. Many years ago on a three-week Bible study vacation in Gloucester, where Gloucester, I always got problem with this pronunciation. Gloucester, And I began to push my thumbs into his eyeball sockets harder and deeper and harder until, yes, they burst in a duet of punctured pain. The ooze slipping down my hands and wrists looked like a raspberry panna cotta. <laughs> Breakdown, that's what I had. Cackety ping, cackety ping, cackety ping. Oh, I am engrossed like a demented evil in Glenny, deaf to your anguish cries. Where's my knife and fork? Where's my plate, please? Where is it? I made a little rhyme. No cutlery, no crockery makes mealtimes a mockery. <laughs> 